Before we get started with this vid, when it comes to the Umbrella Corporation, they have this T-Virus, biological weapon. There's super zombies that come out, like these tyrants. Mr. X is one of them. There's actually two different versions of him, the remake and the original. Led to get it. But how strong is he like this? This form has different transformations. Like he will turn into a super tyrant form if his limiters are messed up. You will see him transform, bulk up to an even more dangerous threat than he was before, even though he was already pretty freaking strong without freaking mutating like this. Mutations aside, multiple vehicles they try to use as a barricade. He could toss them that far. It only makes sense that he can straight up lift up cars. It seems to be super casual, effortlessly type stuff. Yeah. Stuff being catapulted at him, he just catches it like that. Don't sleep on his strength. Get that off of me. Even strong enough to hold back a, a large missile while it's literally in the middle of firing. Even the missile looks bigger than him. Tanks can weigh up to 60 plus tons. This tank charges to him like this. Look how big his size compares to it. Yeah. Is that strength or what? Stops it dead in his tracks. Enhanced durability and healing factor even being dropped from extremely long distances. It's not an end all be all. Even being set on fire doesn't necessarily cut it, even big explosions. You're just going to have to do better than that overall. Even large gas explosions like this, boom. Yeah, you see the distance of how wide that is? All it did was destroy his limiter to where he would just power up and mutate even more. Like I said a second ago, limiter jacket. Even can withstand point blank gunshots to the face. Why would you even try? No. Even survives burning in hot liquid metal. Look at that. Survived all of that madness. Pretty much any version of him can take withstand stuff that can level buildings, like in this occasion, the Stinger missile. He gets hit by it. That's not enough. It takes a tank shell to finally finish him, though, or a Gatling gun to shred him up. So it takes some extreme amount of force to even kill these type of beings. Can react to agile stuff like this. Liquor, you get murked. Even when multiple liquors try to blitz him, no, he's handling the blitz, gets chopped. Implied to be able to react to this missile, stop it before he gets hit on time. Even fighting speed to catch an RPG out of the air, boom. Even the jacket you see him wearing has a purpose. It's durable, enough to withstand handgun shots too, so that ain't gonna cut it. And even stop assault rifle fire, because it's just that durable. In the Resident Evil saga, tyrants is a thing that's like a reoccurring thing and they terrorize the human characters and you have to fight against them. <laughs> I want to quickly go over the one known as Mr. X, which was requested. This company likes to make bioweapons and one of the examples of a scary bioweapon is Mr. X. The T-virus infection is what creates these savage beasts. I already have a video about West Girl on the channel. He's like a super zombie that's way better than your average zombie called a tyrant is what Mr. X is and a couple other ones are like nemesis part of it is because they have way better intelligence than the other zombies too wipe out all witnesses was his objective it's proven that these things are tyrants different type of zombies they have incredible strength i would not be wanting to run away from these things look it does this to the elevator doors with its raw strength like yo you are not safe by nobody and there's no surprise he's starting to break through reinforced glass though it was already cracked you're not even freaking safe even if he gets trapped in a shipping container because he can freaking get out Ain't that scary. Thick concrete walls. He can burst through them and you're done. He can pick you up one arm, choking you out. Swap vehicle. Nope. And y'all thought y'all could just talk and like y'all, that was the end for him. No, it wasn't. Y'all might as well not even hide behind concrete walls no more. Almost pointless at this point. I'm just saying. You have to have plot armor, man, because look what he does to a helicopter, my dude. Yeah. And this brick wall, he says, nope, you come here. Yeah, it just gets bullied. Curb stomped that way. He can withstand gigantic explosions. Yeah, like that. Still walks it off like that multiple times. And again. Yeah. Yeah. Even when this truck explodes on him, guess what? Later, he is shown to survive. It's going to take more than that long jumps like that he can just land and be okay from you got the base form then you got the super tyrant mr x not only is he just chilling while he's on fire but he also breaks through this large chunk of debris with striking power the only thing to really do him in is the anti-tank rocket launcher he took a multitude of bullets and all this crazy stuff it's a testament to his power anti-tank rocket which is what se sealed the deal 
for him. It's basically like saying we needed the force to, that can level a building to take this being out. But at the end of the day, what do you guys think? How strong do you think Mr. X is? The stuff it takes to take this dude out on no matter which continuity is crazy. How do these humans be surviving this long? Part of its plot, like why didn't you just pop his head off as soon as you take a grip of him? You know what I mean? And I'm not getting anywhere near him, but that's none of my business. Well, I would take him on if I had the Hulk strength. How about that? But that's none of my business. But I also have to give a shout out to those that have taken the time to donate to the channel. Helps out a lot. Believe it or not. Respect Mr. X. Be sure to check out my Albert Wesker video I have on the channel too. I'm glad you are enjoying your time on the channel. Make sure you check out the playlist on the channel to see other How Strong videos. If you like what this channel is offering, make sure you hit that subscribe button and I will see you guys later.